Welcome to my YouTube channel Modi Mechanical Engineering Tutorials. In this video, I would like to explaining about various applications and the basic theory about vernier beveled protector. So basically that will be used to measuring an angle of objects. So let us start with the basic introduction about beveled protector. So basically as we discussing, it will be used to measuring an angle. So angle is defined as the opening between two lines which meet at a single point. So you can easily measuring. So basically the circle you already know that it will be dividing into the 360 part or you can say 360 degrees and each part it will be measuring as a one degree. So each degree that will be dividing into the 60 minutes and each minutes that will be one more time it will be dividing into 60 seconds so this is the standard it will be used for indicating the angles of your object or you can say two parts so the unit of angle derived from the theoretical considerations is the radian by defining as an angle substantiated at a center of circle by an r length equal to the radius of the circles. So let us see the vernier beveled protractors. So this is the most simple instruments for measuring the angle between two phases into the workshop or you can say any kind of components. The main scale onto the protector is dividing into the degrees from 0 to 90 degree each way or you can say from both the side. So this is the bevel protectors without actuate angle attachment. So just you can see this is my main scale. So it will be having a 0, 10, 20 up to 19 and from another side it will be 0, 10 up to the 19. And this is also the one year scale it will be indicating over here and this is my lock key. And uh, as per my size and the shape of the components I would like to use the different size of the blades. So this is the basic construction of well protectors without actuate angle attachments. Now we will see the width or uh, actuate angle attachment. So just you can see here that would be the actuate angle attachment over here. So this is my one of the working edges. This is my blade and that will be also having a blade edge. And according to my shape of the measurement or you can say two adjacent side of the components it will be adjusted with the blade edge and the working edge and you can take the reading from the main scale reading as well as by using the vernier scale readings. So this is the standard methodology for measuring a direct measurement of angles. Now we will see this is my actual bevel protectors. So this is my blade edge. This is my main scale. This one is my vernier scale with the, some zooming facilities are there. This is my locking screen and this is my one of the adjustment blade. So this is without actuate angle attachment and this is my second figure with a actuate angle attachment. So this is my base blade main scale vernier scale. So you can easily adjusting two surfaces of your component over here and you can take the measurement of an angle. So this is the direct measurement techniques. Now the various applications of the vernier beaver protectors. So just you can see. So by the using of this for checking the inside bevel face of the ground surfaces. So you can easily measuring that ground surfaces. Second one use of this bevel protector for checking the v block so this is my v block that will be resting onto the table and this is my blade and this is my adjustment so you can easily measuring the angle then after this is the third applications measuring the actuate angle 
so this is the one kind of adjustment of the blade as well as the base and you can take the readings many more readings are there just and wait so these all are the measurement you can use with the different objects so this is the measuring of the angle of this component this is also the angle of this component this is my one of the components or you can say different shape of the components are here so as per your requirement of the measuring the angle between two surfaces you can easily adjusting the blade as well as the base so this is i think one two three four five six seven eight nine so nine different kind of positioning of the bevel protector is there and you can make the angle either it will be the inside either it will be the outside so whatever it may be you can check with the help of direct measurement after this this is the actual practice this is my component this is made of the wooden components and this is my adjustment of the base and the blade and you can take the reading with the main scale as well as with the help of vernier scale this is also some more position for measuring an angle so measuring acute angles this is for measuring the obtuse angle now how you can take the reading that is also one of the important part so into the scales basically two kind of scale one is a main scale readings so this is and another one it will be my vernier scale readings so what you seen so as shown into the main scale that will be graduated it into the degree of the arc where the one year scale that will be having a twelve divisions each side of the center zero so what you mark so that will be having a zero to sixty minute of an arc so that each divisions that will be equal one by twelfth of the sixty so that means the five minute of an arc so these 12 divisions occupy the same space as a 23 degree onto the main scale so here that will be the 23 degrees so each division of the vernier that will be equal to 1 by 12 or you can say 23 degree or you can say in some another manner 1 into 11 by 12 so that will be nothing but it will be the 23 degree so now this is the one of the adjustment of the main scale reading and vernier scale reading so just you can see how you can take the readings so vernier bevel protector that will be equal to the largest whole degree of the main scale plus reading onto the one year scale in line with the main scale divisions so let us see that will be equal to the main scale reading it will be around 51 degree just you can see this is the 50 55 so that will be the one so you can considering as a 51 degree and the which number it will be in line with the main scale reading so just you can see this is the zero from so both then it will be up to 60 up to 60 so from this side the 45 number it will be coincide with the main scales so 51 plus one year that will be having a 45 marks so how you can take the readings 51 degree and 45 minutes that will be the measurement from the one year bevel protectors that optical bevel protectors this is the geometry it will be quite similar as we discussing so in that case the circle that will be divided at one minute intervals throughout the circle and that is fitted inside of the body the smaller microscope that will be also fitted over that for accurate viewing the graduations adjustable blade is clamped to rotating the member which carried its microscope now combination sets as you can see 
so with the help of this combination set you can use number of measurements so here that will be my steel rules and here it will be the square heads with the spirit levels this is my center heads this is my bevel protectors so this all attachment it will be used for the measurement after this this is the position of the bevel protectors so you can make a uh, different applications for the measuring an angle just you can see So I hope you understand this. If you like this, then subscribe and share more the mechanical engineering tutorials. Thank you so much.